What's up guys, it's Nojo Dex here and welcome back to Survival Madness Adventures, made on creative and played on survival and today we have actually got quite a funny day today because we have found out where Cemento is. <laughs> Cemento has actually been trapped in Atlantis. <laughs> I know some of you guys are going to be like, what? Atlantis? Yes, we actually left him there and we didn't actually know he was there. We've actually located him through one of Sir Minecraft guy's devices. He's working with the scientists as we speak. The scientists had to go on and work where Amazing Asian is, but uh, again, and also Ant Killer, but we don't know where they are. So anyway, I'm going to go see what Sir Minecraft guy do is doing today and then we're going to go on our journey back to Atlantis to find where Cemento is. I've heard he's over there that way. If you guys are having a good day, Make sure to drop that like, it also helps a lot. And let's go and see what Sir Minecraft Guy is doing. Okay. Um, Sir Minecraft Guy? What, what's this? Huh? What's, Sir, Sir Minecraft Guy? What's this? What's this? No, no, no. You've done this on purpose, haven't you? What's with the lily pads? How? Hold on a minute. So, oh, whoa. Toilet is like broken. What's happened to do Crunchy Munchy? He must have. Is he flushed away or something? Where's he gone? To Crunchy Munchy. Oh, I can't even get over there. This smell is awful, Sir Minecraft guy. That's disgusting. You're swimming in your own pee pee. This is horrible. And you're saying that you haven't done this on purpose, but where did you get the lily pads from? Huh? Where did you get the lily pads from? You should have come and get me earlier. This is. Oh, man. This is disgust. Fix it, okay? Fix it, all right? This is wrong. You're jumping and you. Oh, man. Nah. Nah, we're getting out of here. Come. Oh, I just fell. Oh. <sighs> so Minecraft guy, it's okay because you know, you know what the cats and dogs do, how they clean themselves. But me, man, this is disgusting. Okay, let me just jump. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> okay, right now that I smell like a fish. Okay, now, now let's go and save uh, Cemento. That's quite ironic, isn't it? Fish, Cemento. Well, you know, dolphin, mammal thing, whatever. So, oh, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Ozzy's going to come on our adventure today. So, Ozzy, we're going to go see what Ozzy's doing. I think he's a bit sleepy because we are going on this adventure late at night, simply because we don't want to get attacked by any mobs or anything. Oh, hello, Ozzy, with your lovely pink uh, dress or whatever. So, <laughs> he's boogieing away. Ozzy, come here because you know what we like to do every episode. We like to stroke Ozzy's face. Ready? <laughs> You love that, don't you, Ozzy? You always love a little bit of, um, you know, a bit of stroking and all that on the face. So, anyway, guys, we are going to go and save Cemento. I mean, I'm a bit, a bit, a bit annoyed, you know, the fact that we left him there. I mean, he's probably not eaten for like five days or something. I mean, how long has it been since we've been to Atlantis? It's been about a couple, it's been about five days, hasn't it? It's been quite a while. I think, you know, he's probably starving, or he's probably having the time of his life. I don't know, but Cemento is trapped somewhere in Atlantis, and we need to go and find him. So, I guess what we'll do is, since we're going late at night, we'll just go and get some boats. Do you know where we can get some boats, anybody, or are we going to have to swim? Anybody know where we can get some boats? I should know, but then... Oh, Ozzy, you've got loads of mail in here. What is this? You've got crazy stuff. You've got some cake. I've got some... Whoa, someone's throwing me some diamonds when I wasn't realising. Wow, this is crazy. I'm already rich. Lo, 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 lo. Oh, <laughs> there's cake and food. There's, like, cake everywhere. And also, guys, we're also preparing for Halloween. As you can see, the world is changing into a marvellous Halloween area. Uh, so, Minecraft guy, I'm going to tip you with all these diamonds because I simply don't want to be holding them because diamonds aren't my cup of tea. Also, I don't want to take my armor or my butt whooper with me this adventure so i will quickly go and put them in let's see if there's anything in here i guess i'll just put them in here and there we are so uh so minecraft guy and ozzy have you still not found where we can find some boats the boat store has been destroyed because toxic thought it would be okay if we'd move it somewhere else so well, what's this over here what does this say this says Shh, the scientist is working. So this is where you guys actually are building. This is where the scientist is working, right outside in the middle of the night. Well, that's really clever, isn't it? I'm surprised he's not been eaten or something by zombies. Oh, well, well, at least he's... Well, I, I, I can't... Oh, I can't. <laughs> he has, I guess I've not given him a house or anything. So he has to live outside here. Uh, I'm guessing, guys, that we're going for a good old swim. Oh, Sir Minecraft Guy is using his initiative to break down one of the trees that has probably been there for years, longer than him that's ever existed, to then build a boat that is probably going to break in a couple of seconds. And now Ozzy... Uh, no, it basically was a hint to the, for them not to necessarily break and that we would just actually go for a swim. But knowing a meerkat and a dog, they're quite, you know, they're, they're quite special. And 
now Ozzy's being chased by a pig. <laughs> okay, guys, are you... Oh, where's Ozzy gone? Ozzy! Ozzy! Are you okay? <laughs> Where... You just saw him like... <laughs> Meerkats are really cool at, like, climbing out of little holes as well. <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> wow, I feel like I'm going to just choke on my own laughs. Anyway, so Sir Mycroft Guy and Ozzy, they're making the boats as we speak. Thank you very much. And this is tends to be quite a long venture just to save our lovely beloved dolphin. Which again, I have to say, has been quite relaxing without the dolphin here. I don't know why. Maybe it's because when he's like asleep, he always snores and he makes like these noises like... <laughs> Sounds a little bigger like a horse. It's quite weird. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, I think you're probably thinking a bit crazy, but you know, or because I am crazy. <laughs> so, Sam Minecraft guy and Ozzy, let's go and save uh, Mr. Cemento on this lovely venture. So, we get the boats down here, we get into the boat, we steer it in the right direction, and I believe Antis, is, Al Antis? Atlantis is behind this lovely place over here. Wow, look at the miles per hour I'm going on this. We're going at least 100 knots at least. It's going like a super speedboat. Like, if I put some super speedboat sounds on it, right? Let me, like, let, but let me put the speedboat sound on right now. Or like extra sound effect. So yeah, I casually broke the boat. And Ozzy's coming in around the corner. He's like, oh, slow down. Like scrapes in, does a turn. He's not satisfied. He parks up. He's parking it up. He's parked up. He's like, yeah, I'm satisfied with that. And Sir Minecraft guy, uh, <laughs> he's like, my boat broke. My boat broke in the water. Oh, so Ozzy's pushing the boat to try and get to the Minecraft guy. But Ozzy, Ozzy, so Minecraft guy can swim. Okay. He, he's, he can swim. He's okay. Oh, yeah. So anyway, we're going to do a ninja jump down here. Ooh. Whoa, 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 Ninja Dump's not working. What? <gasps> what is one heart? Oh, that is so lucky. For some reason, Ninja Dump's aren't working in this area. This is really weird. Maybe, the, like, the Atlantis power or something is, like, restricting us from, like, able to, I don't know, like, maybe do these jumps and stuff? Well, nonetheless, if we can't Ninja Jump, we'll find out where he is. So, again, I'm not sensing that there's any uh, evil around here. I don't have my butt whipper on me because I do remember defeating all the evil and all darkness around here. Now, we never really checked inside these buildings. If everybody can quickly check inside one of these houses, because, again, we were so rushed off our feet last time that we were fighting hundreds of mobs. We had to get out of here simply to save Blue Beast. That, that is the reason why we actually forgot Cemento. Not justifying myself or anything, but that is definitely the reason. So, we're going to check through these houses and uh, find out what house is actually the right house right now okay guys so we actually looked at all the houses we looked in every single one of them and guess what we're quite ashamed because basically the house had the door was already open look at this look Look, Sir Minecraft guy. Look, Ozzy. We found the house that Cemento is possibly down. Let's go down here. Are we going to take a leap of faith? Ooh. Okay. I'm de it's definitely getting hot, isn't it? It's definitely getting really hot. Usually when you go down in the ground. <gasps> Lava. Look at this. Look at this. This is where he's been trapped. Dr. Forehead trapped him in the cage over there. Hey, Cemento, can you hear us? Cemento. Can you, can you hear us? I don't think he can hear us. We're quite far away. Um, okay, guys. We're going to have to do a bit of parkour. If we die, we're going to have to do the uh, wizardry teleportion trick. Okay. Uh, Sir Minecraft guy, why don't you go first? And if you fall, you'll look like an absolute... Di oh, wow. Sir Minecraft guy. Oh, he's... Oh, there goes... <laughs> there goes Sir Minecraft guy. Hold on. Ozzy, wait a second. You need to get Sir Minecraft guy. Sir Minecraft guy, you can use the wizardry teleportion trick and teleport onto Ozzy. That's no problem whatsoever. So, Ozzy's turn to go and do this. Okay, Ozzy, are you ready? He takes a jump. He's going through. He's thinking about this. He's taking, looking left and right. He sees that there's a big lava. Oh, and he falls right in the lava again, but he does the meerkat jump straight out of it. He's eating a golden apple because he's slightly just trying to get his feet. So, he's going to take another jump. He's on fire. He's going really crazy. He's got his sword out. He's clearly feeling very powerful, especially in that pink dress as well. And he's jumping. Oh, oh, oh. He's getting close to the end. I can't really see. He's getting quite far out. So Sir Minecraft guy, you're going to go this time as well. Go, so Mr. Sir Minecraft guy. He just takes a jump. He jumps to the side. He's learnt from his mistakes. He's going. He's jumping. He's going super fast. This dog is literally like a cat. He's got superpowers. He's catching up. And he's directly behind Ozzy. Ozzy's made it. Make sure that Sir... Oi, Ozzy! Make sure that Cemento's okay. Check to see if he's not dead or anything. Because he hasn't eaten in a certain amount of time. Okay, jump. Okay, what? 
Okay, check a jump. These jumps are actually quite easy. Whoever made this parkour or Dr. Forehead thought we weren't actually good at parkour, but clearly he doesn't know that uh, we are great, well-known adventurers that also were well-known champions for the old parkour. So, uh, Cemento, hello. Are you doing okay? You're not, you're not upset or anything. Hey, what's this? What? Are you having a joke? You having a joke? Yeah, you're in a cage, and the and the gate was broken. Are you? No, no. Wait, wait, wait a second. <laughs> you you've been trapped in a broken cage, right? In water. You've enjoyed this, haven't you? You've, you've, you have, haven't you? You've, you're happy being in permanent water. This is probably like a jacuzzi for him. That is really naughty. Come out here this very instant. You've even got chests and everything for ladders. That is really weird. Come here. You naughty, submit. Naughty, naughty. Yeah, I come and save you. Risk our lives. He dies in immense pain and gets teleported back to find out that the cage was already broken and you could have come up and gone and fought, fought with us. You're an absolute disgrace, Mr. Dolphin. We come and save you. Do you know what? I'm going home. I, I tell you, I'm going home. You, I think we should just go home. Let, see you later. See ya. Where's, where's he going? Oh, he's getting now. He's deciding to jump. Well, you better make it, Cemento, because if you teleport. No, see ya. Bye. Oh, so he's doing a dolphin jump. He's going straight up the top. No, nope, no, nope, have none of that. Have another that. No, nope, going home. It's Ozzy, he's falling in the water. Get out of the way, Ozzy. I guess he's going. Oh, there we go. Oh, 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 oh. Did you see that epic, like ninja jump they did? I actually was able to ninja jump then. I think because you. Oh, where's he gone? Is he burnt to death? Is he? No, he's there. <gasps> Ow. Ow. That really hurt, Ozzy. You silly little limb. You silly little meerkat. You naughty little meerkat. You're very, very naughty. You're just naughty. But Cemento, bud, seriously. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? There he is. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. This is really, really crazy. I, I can't believe that. I can't believe the dolphin. One, he was trapped in a cage. We forgot about him. And not only that we forgot about him, he was in a broken cage that he could have left at any time. I reckon, right, he's been treating this as a holiday. He's fed up with us. He probably thought, you know what? I'm going to sit in this cage with a lovely bit of water and a lovely bit of lava just to sort... I bet, what did you eat down there? What did you eat? You, nah, you're lying. You ate your own, you know... You know, you're pee-pee. You know, you're happy. You're one of them fish, aren't you? Ugh, you, you, don't, you don't even touch me. Don't even touch me. Go, go over there. Go. Just, ugh, he touched me. Go, ugh. Uh, uh, don't touch him. Run. Uh, ah, run. Run. Quickly, just get out of here. Quick. Ooh. Okay, ninja jump everywhere. Ooh. Oh, oh, did you see that super speed swimming motion? I guess I learned that from Cemento as well. But we have literally... Don't go near him. He's filthy. He needs a wash or... Oh, just... Ugh. Okay, guys. We're, we're going to go to the Hall of Adventures to add someone really, really special this evening as well, guys. I've got a very special person to be added to the Hall of Adventures. And uh, you guys will see the reason as well. So, see you guys in the Hall of of adventurers what's up guys and welcome back to the hall of adventurers and today you can tell that we're outside the lovely one and only sir minecraft guy to add one special hall of adventurer and this is actually a really really good hall of adventurer reason to be added and a good reason for any of you future hall of adventurers that would like to also be added to the hall of adventurers i know i said that word four thousand times but i didn't because i'm only joking so mwahahaha it makes no sense so let's go into sir minecraft guy <laughs> and let's go down him and let's see who has been added i'm actually really excited to talk about this person in particular because it's very very great to see these things so let me eat this golden apple just the tension of seeing who's been added is person Aoife morris if that's how you say your name congratulations you have been added to the hall of ventures because of the drawing on screen now so, the drawing, as you can see, it says Survival Madness at the top in red. It also has Nitrate DX, my original PC skin, which is also great to see. We also have Mizzle for Shizzle on the left, the villager with the lovely villager voice. We haven't seen him in a very long time. I think we should all leave in the comments section below saying we miss the good old great builder villager. And Sir Minecraft Guy in his original dog form, which is great. We also have Sky Lethal, which again, we haven't seen in a very long time. We also have Blue Beast, which is looking absolutely crazy as we usual 
and we have the bunny George on the far right. And not only that, which really made me laugh, we have Dr. Forehead in the ground, which looks really good as well. So, guys, that is the picture for you. Congratulations again, Ethan Morris, for being added to the Hall of Adventures. And, guys, for you guys that also would like to be added to the Hall of Adventures, this is a great great way to actually get yourselves added to the Hall of Adventures through actually sending in a drawing via email or any source of media that you guys can get the picture to me that would be awesome and we can show you on this lovely video so guys if you thought the video was good please drop a like if you're new to the channel or enjoy this video make sure to hit that subscribe button and as always guys make sure to have a good day goodbye